Welcome back to another video guys. Today we're going to be taking a look at the Exposure Lights Trace Mark II and the Trace R light set. So first off, taking a look at the box here, we can see that it's made in Great Britain, so it should be pretty high quality. And here down at the bottom, you can see the lumens as well as the runtime. Taking a look at the box at the side here, uh, it shows some of the features that the light has. So we can just take a look here, three main features that the light offers. And last one, fuel gauge, and we'll be going through how to operate the light in a little bit. So let's take a look at the back of the box here. So it's basically explaining how these lights are extremely good at lighting up your path. So 360 degrees around you, it will allow for the light to travel um, even if it's bright outside because of the technology that it uses in its lens. So they recommend using it in urban or road conditions. And yeah, this is what the lights are good at. And this is what it comes with in the box. So let's go ahead and open it right now. So I'm just gonna undo it. And the first thing we see is own the night. So yeah, this is what they preach that at night, you're just gonna own the road because that's how bright these lights are. So let's slide it out the box. So here we have the Trace R and the front light Mark II. So both pretty small and compact, which I like. It also includes two charging cables. So both USB, uh, micro USB, sorry, as well as stickers and an instruction manual. All right, so now I'm gonna go over how to actually use this. So if you hold this down, the light will flash and the number of times it flashed, so that was three flashes, uh, you can hold it down and it will stay at that setting for the rest of the time. So now I'm just gonna hold it down. It should flash twice now and I'm gonna let go. So now it's on the second setting, which is the medium setting. And uh, last but not least, I'm gonna hold it down and it's gonna flash once. And that's the brightest setting, which is also their day bright setting, uh, which allows you to be seen uh, even when it's extremely sunny outside. So you double click twice to on it. So this is the first setting and this is the flash setting and hold it to turn it off again. So I'm gonna be holding it three times just to show you the difference. And look at the difference. This is the lowest setting and the light is significantly dimmer. This is in flashing mode and turn it off. All right, so this is the mount that will go on your seat post. So you're gonna mount this red part onto your seat post and it also comes with a saddle mount, which is nice if you wanna put it under your saddle for aesthetic purposes, it comes separately. Uh, taking a look here, if this, there's this pull tab that you pull down and it will access the micro USB charging port. There you have it, it's pretty tight as it allows it to be weatherproof. Um, it's not completely waterproof, but it will be water resistant. So if it rains, it shouldn't be a problem. Um, so I'm gonna put it back here. Pretty tough to put back again. Make sure it's sealed and there are no gaps. All right, so that's just a quick look at our exposure lights. Um, I feel like these lights are extremely a uh, value for money, extremely bright, and it'll keep you visible uh, regardless of light setting outside, whether it's bright, whether it's dark. So if you're a beginner and looking for a set of good lights, I'll highly recommend these. Alright, thank you for watching this quick little video on the exposure lights. I hope you enjoyed it and see you in the next video.